So are you interested in coming back as Senate President? I'm looking forward to the uh, completion of the investigation. It's underway. And um, I'm here representing my constituents and plan to uh, continue to do my job. Can you confirm that you've separated from Brian? I have. Can you tell us what was behind that decision? Um, that's personal, and uh, he is uh, getting the treatment uh, for alcohol uh, that he needs, and um, that's about all that can be said about that. Senator, can you sort of describe what the last few weeks have been for you? Personally, obviously, you've been away from this building, but what have, what have been for you? I've been in my district where I usually spend most of the holiday season, and um, I'm back now along with uh, my colleagues to, to do our jobs. Have what you sort of reception did you with get Hogan Lovell's investigators? I uh, have not. What sort of reception did you get from your fellow uh, senators? Uh, very uh, positive, friendly, and uh, exactly what I would expect from my colleagues with whom I've served and worked for so long. Did you discuss the Senate presidency with your colleagues? I did not. Well, have you gotten any pledges of support that they would support you if you were to receive it? I have not discussed anything with regard to what's going to happen once the investigation is complete with uh, my colleagues. At this point, they have been counseled that they should minimize contact with me so that uh, we can be sure out of an abundance of caution that uh, nothing can be said when the investigation is over that there was any interference. You know he's Do you, he's do you, okay. do you anticipate with back. Brian and treatment now that investigators will be speaking with him in the course of no, the investigation? No, I can't speak to that. No. I can't speak. No. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Senator. Thank you, Senator. Thank you, Senator.